Hi, this is my second vlog, BTW. I wanted to sort of talk about um, regarding some of my my pet peeves. So a little bit of a background history. Um, I grew up in Orange County, the OC. That's hot. I am I am black. I was one of like ten black people graduated from my high school. When you do have a token black friend, just try to like not say things that could possibly be offensive. Regardless, it's still a friend and you want to keep them around. You could get black handed. Don't want that. Because you know that black people throw really well because we're always playing sports. So the last thing you want to do is get your face. So I wanted to talk about five things. Five things not to do or to say around your black token female friends. Can I touch your hair? No. Frankly, that's just, it's kind of weird. It's sort of creepy. Like, do you want me to like cut a piece of my hair off and put it in a little baggie and give it to you so you can put it under your pillow at night? before you fall asleep. And then, honestly, like, what am I, some sort of alien from fucking Planet Negro? Like, can't we just talk? The N-word. Now, we know that it is bad. This is something that is known. Regardless of what your personal beliefs are about the word, I mean, the fact is that, like, people believe that if it ends in an A, then it's okay, and it ends in an E-R, you can't say it. Um, it's not socially acceptable. If you feel, if you feel like right now you can get up and go to your local mall and then just say the word over and over and over again and not care, then you are, com you're completely mistaken because that will happen. So the fact is that it's just, it's a, it's a stigma. You can't say the word. So, since we know we can't say the word, just because you have black friends doesn't mean you can. Just say the N word. Because then you won't get backhanded. And that means a good day for you. Stereotypes suck. I personally stay far, far, far away from them. We all can sing, we can all rap, we all can dance really well, we all play every sport really well except for hockey, and even if we decided to play hockey, we'd probably excel because we are like, derived directly from Kenyans and can run really, really fast. Do not ask your friends, your black friend, if she can see walk. Don't. I repeat, don't. Please don't ask your friend if she can do the soul of boy. You can't ask her that. Because we know that she can't. Just don't tell her to do it. Dance, Negro, dance. Saying that you love black people, I mean, that's great, and hey, we love you too, um, but it's like saying, I, I love dolphins, I, I love giraffes, I love lamps, I love clothes, I love getting my nails done, I love black people. I love hats. I'm glad that we can entertain you. Shook and jab, shook and jab, shook and jab. I'm telling you this just to save you from dirty looks and your black friend just not answering your phone calls very often anymore and you wondering. If you turn on the TV, you're going to see hundreds of thousands of beautiful people. Of those beautiful people, there are a very small handful of female black ones. The, the issue is that when you turn on the TV, everything is fair skin, light hair, straightened hair, thin, you know, those, that's what's beautiful. Um, and you don't see that in real life. So then the regular women like myself, who are not thin, I'm very proud of that, um, who don't straighten their hair, um, who don't get plastic surgery, and don't try to conform themselves to that 
desire, that idea of beautiful. You just find all these beautiful black men, and they're not with a beautiful brown skinned woman. And the idea of beauty is warped in the media, and so it kind of hurts black girl. Just don't tell me that you love black men. So do I. They're fucking amazing. You don't see internet racial relationships so much with a black woman. You know what I mean? So it's just frustrating that that idea of beauty gets lost in our culture. Anyway, so don't tell me you love black men. Just love them. Those are my five things not to tell your token black girlfriend because she will get mad at you on the inside. She won't tell you because she loves you and you guys have a great friendship. But she'll be dreaming and in her dreams she'll be about giving you the black hand. Black hand. I'm out. Leave me comments. I'm pointing at my crotch but I really mean like down where the comments are. I mean, you can comment on my crotch if you want to, but I'll remember to it. So, until next time. <laughs>